So we had Jimmy Burroughs was on because he just, oh. he's written this memoir. Great memoir. About, and he just talks about all the, tel- but in in the book, and we asked him, I know your friends now, but. Yeah, yeah. When the friends, he, I know it. Yeah, I he, read that section. Yeah. When the Friends pilot was in production, <laughs> he wrote this. I because he was directing the pilot of Friends. When the Friends pilot was in production, I heard from someone on the show that Lisa said that fucking Jimmy Burrows is directing the show. Yeah. Can you believe it? Because you had a whole history with him, and I wanted you to talk about that evolution of that relationship. Yeah, because like the just that was it that same season. No, year this a couple of years. Yeah, before, a year I before. Think. Year, a year. A year before, I was cast in Frasier as Roz, mistakenly cast, but um, I didn't know that at the time, and <laughs> I, I knew that Jim Burroughs clocked that I was wrong for it from the table read, and so I thought, oh, he doesn't like me, like he doesn't like what I do, um, you know, so then we're doing. Friends, and I had to do a special audition just for Jim Burroughs. You know, oh. like you do like you producers and then studio, studio again, network. But in between all of that, I had to go in and read for Jim Burroughs. And, and I thought, well, maybe everyone has to read for Jim Burroughs, you know. I found out last year when we did the reunion or something, like, or no, no, not the reunion. It was a tribute to Jimmy a few years ago. No, I was the only one that had to... <laughs> Read for him, just to wow. make sure it was all okay with Jimmy that I play Phoebe or go to the studio for Phoebe or now we're, yeah. So I just then we're there and yeah, and I just I don't think I said it like that. I think it was more like, uh, fucking Jimmy Burroughs is directing this. <laughs> I just, it was more like in defeat, not angry, right? Defeated right? and then, demoralized. And then he tells the story, but. We're doing a run through. We're getting ready to do a run through, and I have to do my Phoebe monologue. And he's like, "Lisa, sit under the table to to read the monologue." What? Yeah, do it from under the table. You know, she's out there. And I just went, oh, "My God, I can't connect with anybody." I'm just com- if if you need to demonstrate how much the character doesn't belong with these people, which I knew <laughs> was something they were sort of concerned about. Well, we're just going to highlight it, demonstrate it right now. So I did that. I did the best I could. And sure enough, after the run through, David Crane says, and then Lisa, it's fun that you're under the table. As if it was my idea. Right. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's no. it's horrible. fun Man. that you're under the table. But I'm not sure that it works under the table. I don't, I'm not sure that works. And I just went, okay, yeah. Because I'm not going to say, Jimmy, maybe, you know. And But then, like, the mensch he is, Jimmy said, no, that was my idea. Yeah, we don't, that, we don't have to do that. And I just went, oh, thank God. And I saw that he wrote in, he wrote in there that then I, she could know that she could trust me. Yes. And he was right. And then you cast him oh, yeah. as a director mm-hmm. in The Comeback. Right, memorably. perfect. Yes, because, yeah, I mean, I... We grew, I not grew to love him. I always wanted to love him. I just thought he hated me. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, no, because for Valerie, we needed the, you know, the top director for sitcoms, like irrefutably the top. And that's Jim Burroughs. That's shorthand. And, and you don't even need to be in this business. We're just telling you it is. But it's fun to see actual Jimmy Burroughs. I don't know who's going to be Jim Burroughs. So, yeah, he 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 did it and he was perfect and fantastic, even though he thought it was mean. And, you know, it wasn't that he's being mean. That's who that's who Jim Burroughs is, too. I mean, it's the person who's just going to tell you the truth. Not trying to take you down. He's just telling you what you need to know. He's trying to save you. 